Hi everyone and thanks for tuning in to Smash Factor TV. My name's Natalie Adams. We're going to have a look at the role of footwork in your golf swing to get you striking the ball a lot better hitting it a lot more consistently, straighter and further. And I think one of the biggest uh, misconceptions with uh, amateur golfers is what right foot should be doing in the golf swing. So if we have a look at the swing and what we want to see with footwork is as you're making your back swing that the, the feet stay quite planted to the floor, weight stays uh, quite even so it's not really moving around too much in the feet as such it's going into the right heel as you're swinging back so you're transferring your weight into your right side but on the downswing so as we approach the top of the swing and we start to go into transition which means that the club is still making its uh, movement towards the target and then your legs start to move towards the target we need to get the the feet and the weight rolling more in the feet especially in this right foot we want to get the right foot really rotated over so that this knee can turn in so that the hips can then rotate through so if we look from this side what we'd want to work on is just making the back swing and then really rotating that right foot over so that you can see the underside and the sole of my shoe there I think too many uh, amateur golfers will tend to lift the right heel uh, in, in order to get the weight transferred to the left side but the issue with doing that is as you lift the right heel it, it lifts the right hip and as you lift your right hip it's going to lift your right shoulder and you're going to make a very over the top movement it's going to be difficult to counter that unless you've got a very close club face and you're quite flat on your backswing so what i would suggest we do is work on swinging to the top and then as you start to, to move your weight onto your left side do it in a way where the right foot really rolls in a lot more so that you uh, roll onto the inside of that right foot you're showing all of the sole underneath your foot into that sort of position through impact and then up onto the toe as you follow through so I'm going to show you a little bit of footage here of two current tour players you can have a look at how their uh, foot movement uh, and especially the right foot's working as you go through impact okay so if we have a look at uh, we've got two tour players up here on uh, our screen we've got uh, Jordan Spieth on the left and Adam Scott on the right hand side if we just have a look at their movement on the downswing if we watch Jordan first just watch his right foot movement as he comes down through transition and into impact so he's not lifting his right heel off the floor at all okay as he goes through impact there's a real roll over onto the inside of his foot as he strikes through the ball if we have a look at Adam's movement here as well I'm going to see him into transition and down into the downswing and again just watch that right foot action there's not really a big lift in that right heel at all it's more roll onto the inside of the shoe Adam just gets a little bit higher with his right foot off the floor but it's really really minimal so what we want to do to ensure that we're rotating well and swinging um, on a better plane on that downswing and not getting too much on the outside is we need to, to work on that right foot movement and of rolling the weight really rolling onto the inside of that right foot so that the hips can rotate towards the target. So after seeing those two uh, swings and the movement in the right foot there really work on uh, getting that feeling of rolling the right foot really moving the knee inwards so that you roll over on that right foot rather than lifting the heel up directly off the floor if you can get the feet working a lot better and get that right foot with more of a rolling action in it you'll still transfer your weight onto your left side but I think you'll uh, stay on plane hit much more from the inside it's a much more powerful move you'll get more turn into your hips it's a game-changing golf tip. Yeah. 